Egypt is preparing to crack down on any police officers found guilty of abuse. President Abdel Fattah el-Sisi gave that order to his interior minister and proposals to achieve this goal will be submitted before parliament. The directive comes following the recent death of a man at the hands of police sparking outrage in Cairo. Here's CCTV's Adel Makroui. Egypt has two kinds of police officers, those who graduate from the police academy and cadets. The latter are not as rigorously trained and have clashed with citizens on several occasions. Those clashes have sparked a rising anger among Egyptians. For instance, doctors held a nationwide protest saying the violations should not be tolerated. Last Thursday, hundreds protested after a police cadet shot and killed an Egyptian man. When police cadets were exempted from standing in front of the military court and were replaced by disciplinary courts, that had a great impact on the behavior of some police cadets after January Revolution. There are still some punishment which could lead to dismissal from duty. President Abdel Fattah Sisi has responded to the popular anger. He has called on the Interior Ministry to amend disciplinary laws within 15 days. There are about six official officers inside the ministry that monitor and punish police officers, including the National Security Bureau, the police management in each governorship, and the General Security Bureau. Many say the Interior Ministry needs to do more to ensure police are held accountable for their actions. There are over 130,000 cadets and security personnel in the Interior Ministry. That's more than triple the officers in Egypt. So any improvement in the cadets' performance will be beneficial for the police as well as the safety of the citizens. Adel Mahroui, CCTV, Cairo.